Agrobacterium tumefaciens is a soil-dwelling bacterium which resides in the rhizosphere and utilizes nutrients from the plant to survive. However, if the plant is damaged, the agrobacterium moves to the site of injury via chemotaxis as a response to chemoattractants released by the injured cells. Among the molecules released from the wounded plant tissue is the phenolic molecule acetosyringone and this molecule binds to a receptor on the bacterium encoded by the bacterium's virulence A gene. The vir A receptor is a periplasmic protein which exists as a dimer. Upon binding to acetosyringone, it autophosphorylates and the phosphoryl group is subsequently transferred to a protein called vir G. When vir G is phosphorylated, it activates transcription of other virulence factors on the agrobacterium's Ti plasmin. TI stands for tumor-inducing plasmid. This plasmid contains both the genes coding for the vir A and vir G proteins already discussed, as well as other virulence genes. The expression of these genes results in the transfer of the plasmid's tDNA, or transfer DNA, into the host cell. This causes the plant cells to proliferate and produce molecules that the agrobacterium can use for energy. The first step of this transfer occurs when the proteins encoded in the virulence D genes nick and cleave the tDNA and also covalently attach to the 5' end of the tDNA strand. After the tDNA is excised from the plasmid, the vir E proteins bind to the tDNA strand to prevent it from being degraded by nucleases upon transfer and likely aid in localization to the nucleus as well. Meanwhile, the vir B genes are expressed and the products of these genes form a type 4 secretion system that forms a pore between the bacterium and the plant cells. The tDNA is able to move through this pore to the interior of the plant cell and continue on to the nucleus where the tDNA is integrated into the host's genome. This mechanism for the transfer of DNA into a plant cell is valuable to biotechnologists for the creation of transgenic plants. If the genes on the tDNA are exchanged with genes for a desirable phenotype and genes which have products that can easily be assayed for, then desirable genes can be transferred into plants and the integration of these genes can be tested for.